Good morning, everybody. My name is Mr. Satchmi, and welcome back to Would You Rather. Now, I want to, real quick before we get into this, I want to explain something. So my last two videos, they've been kind of chopped up, and they don't seem like I was trying. I want to explain that. That's because, um, comp play, I get super into and I cuss a lot. Call of Duty, I get super into and cuss a lot. And I, don't, and I don't want my videos to be full of just me cussing at, at, at games. I don't want to be that guy. So I edit out the majority of the cussing, which ends up being the majority of the videos. In those cases, it's not like I'm not trying anymore. It's just that's the way it ended up. Those videos, the scheduling of the videos ended up to where those two were back to back, unfortunately. Anyways, got my... Uh, Nice little Christmas, my ugly Christmas sweater on, in Christmas spirit. Also, it's a little cold, so put jacket on. Anyways, let's get into the game. So, would you rather swim with a great white shark or a killer whale? Well, I'm edumacated in sitch, and I know killer whales can kill sharks. They've done it before, on camera. Not, not I'm not joking, you guys. Like, there was a whole documentary about killer whales a attacking sharks. If you flip a shark upside down, they don't do shit anymore. They, they're not dangerous anymore, which is what the scientists do, is they they turn the sharks upside down when they want to, like, probe them and all that shit. I don't know if they actually probe them or not. It's just the word I used. Anyways, so I'd rather swim with killer whale because they're bigger, they're prettier, and they have nothing against humans. They won't attack you. Yeah, most people agree with me. Would you rather be tall or be short? Well, I'm 6'1", so I think I'm tall. <laughs> uh, but being short just seems like an inconvenience because my, my roommate, he's not, I don't know his exact height, but he's shorter than me. And it's funny when he asks me for help on shit. I always thought that was hilarious. Anyway, I'd rather be tall. I'd rather be me. I do me. Would you rather play with the Miami Dolphins or... Or kiss a rattlesnake and die in seven sec. Oh, jeez. Well, so, I'm a Cowboys fan, which sucks because they just lost yesterday. Ten to seven, close. It was a good game. So a few calls should have been uh, made against the Giants, but we'll not get into that because they'll probably they probably would have still ended up losing. And it sucks that it's they're 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 eleven to two, and the two is both the Giants, unfortunately. Anyways. If you don't care about football, you have no idea what I'm talking about, and you're just like, what the fuck? Anyways, would I rather play with the Miami Dolphins? Well, freshman year, I got offered QB quarterback for high school. I turned it down because I wanted, I didn't want to play QB at all. I wanted to be the kicker. Yeah. But anyway, I'd rather play with the Miami Dolphins. Would you rather be a dolphin or be an octopus? If I could be an octopus, I could do so much at the same time. I'd have eight arms, but dolphins are smart. That's that's a tough one. Ooh, be a dolphin or an See, dolphins also have the sonar stuff. They do breathe air. Octopus. Octopus, I could... I'm going to go with just octopus. Most people disagree with me. Well, how would... Would you rather Manchester United... I don't know what Manchester is, so... Would you rather be an anime man or be an animal? Well, if I'm an anime man, depending on which anime I'm in, I could be fucking amazing. Like, I could be a soul reaper with a giant ass fucking sword. Be like, fuck you, bitch. Or could be an Attack on Titan with a 3DM and just fly around. Yeah. That'd be pretty fucking cool. So, I'm going to say anime. That one's like, I didn't even consider the other one, but I'd rather be in an anime. Would you rather have a book of everything in the future, have a book about everything in the past? Well, I don't like to read, so I'd rather not have a book. I'd rather have a video game. Can I have a video game of everything that's going to happen in the future? Because that would be kind of cool, actually. That'd be that'd be an interesting video game. Like, how would it be set up and all that? Anyways, 
I'm, uh, uh, I'm kind of getting too deep into the thought process of this. Or have a book of everything in the past. So a history book, you're saying. So would I rather have a history book or a history book from the future, basically? <laughs> I'd rather just have a history book. Oh. No, I don't want to know the future, to be honest. I don't want to deal with the time changing the future or whatever. Would you rather Batman, Superman, Batman? That makes no sense. I'm going to skip that. Would you rather have Donald Trump or have Hillary Clinton? I'm not bringing politics. I know my answer, but I'm not going to. Would you rather have a person love you love break your heart or have yourself break the person who you love's heart? Um, will I be in a situation where both those have actually happened at the same time? That wasn't fun. Anyway, I'd rather not talk about that, to be honest. But, to be honest, I'd rather have them, like, hurt me. Because if I love them, I don't want them to get hurt at all. Like, ever. So, I, I'd rather have... I don't know if I picked the right one. It's about 50-50. That's interesting. Would you rather have sex or suck a girl's dick? Well, if it's a girl that has a dick, it's not a girl, is it? Just saying. <laughs> um, so, yeah, have sex. Or I'm, 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 no. Would you rather don't know you are, don't know your family? I'm, okay, I'm guessing it means don't know who you are or don't know who your family is. Uh, would I rather not know who I am or not know who my family is? Hmm. My family is pretty fucking big. I don't know them all anyway, so I could just probably play it off like that if I don't know my family, to be honest. If I don't know my family, I can just be like, and you are, all I gotta do is remember, figure out the important ones, which are my dad, my mom, my brother, that's about it. I'd have three people to figure out if I forgot my family. Me, I'd have one person. And I'm just going to go with me. Just because I'm surrounded by my stuff and it would be easier to... Would you rather go hunting or go fishing? Well, I've never been hunting, to be honest. I've been fishing loads of times. I fucking love it. Um... But right now, would I rather go, I'd rather go out, because right now it's 5 o'clock in the morning, so, I mean, go fishing, like, this is about the time that if me and my dad were to go fishing, that we'd be out at the lake right now, like, we'd just be getting there, and just setting out our lines and everything. And to some of you, that sounds insane, but to a fisherman, you're like, that's not even that early. Well, um, last time I did it, I was 10, I want to say, so... Five in the morning was really early to me, but I'd rather go fishing just because I'd rather go fishing with my dad than, than go hunting, to be honest. Would you rather lead an exciting life until your 30s, lead an average life until your 90s? I'm not average, and I'm only 19, so somehow I turned into Batman, so now I'm Batman. <laughs> I have too much fun with this. Um, would you rather lead an exciting life until your 30s or lead an average life until your 90s? So basically, would I rather be just your normal average everyday Joe until I'm 90? Or be a rich, basically a rich billionaire bachelor type guy until I'm 30? Which would be another 10 years. I'd rather live to my life until my 90s just because I, I don't care if I have an average life. Live at FNAF sister location or live in Hello Neighbor. Okay, so FNAF is Five Nights at Freddy's. If you didn't know, um, they just released their fifth game, which is sister location. It's time it where it falls into the series is still undetermined as far as I know. I'm not sure. Um, but that one is pretty fuck creepy. But I like that game more than Hello Neighbor. Hello Neighbor is still in its early alpha. Um... It's still got a ways before it's a full-fledged game. Basically, the goal of the game... So, you move into this house, and your neighbor 
he drugs you and kicks you out of your house and takes your house. He builds a mysterious basement, which you've never seen before, and it just magically appears the next day when you wake up, somehow. That one I'm not entirely sure about its logic behind, but... Anyway, so you, the goal of the game is to get into the basement. You gotta get the key off of the per of the neighbor, and you gotta get a pry bar for the nails that are on the... I, I, I've seen so much gameplay of this, I know what to do, I don't know how to do it, I've never played it. But from what I've seen, uh, Sister Location is, is, like, I'm not trying to be mean or anything, because Hello Neighbor is still in its early alpha, so comparing the two is kind of unfair, because Sister Location is a fully-fledged game, it's done. While Hello Neighbor is still, it, they're still making it, they're still working on it. So it's, it seems kind of unfair to compare them right now, but as living in them um to be honest uh neither because they both sound equally terrifying i mean the neighbor never kills you so i guess he i mean he just captures you and and throws you out so i mean i guess you could just ultimately leave him alone and, uh, and go find a new house so hello neighbor most people agree with me. i mean i love fnaf i love the games I've never personally played the games, to be honest, because I don't have the uh, the money for them. Nor do I even have a PC, so that's that's my main problem. Anyway, would you subscribe to FNAF World Lover now? I don't know what that is. Subscribe to Little Kelly now. Don't know what that is. Skip. Would you rather St. Louis Cardinals or Chicago Cubs? When I was little... My biological mom, she followed baseball. So did I, back when Sammy Sosa was on the Cubs. I didn't follow it that heavily. She followed it. Holy shit. Ah! I'm attached, so I'm backing up too far. Anyway. So, uh, I believe that Sosa did go to the Cardinals at, after he was done at the Cubs. I know most people are probably going to pick Cubs just because they won the World Series this year. But I want to clarify, I'm going to pick Cubs, yes. But it's not for it's not because they won the World Series this year. It's because back when I was little, I used to love the Cubs. So, Cubs. Would you rather... I can't see that. Move my face. Would you rather die and see... Somehow your funeral to know who would come. So die and see, watch your funeral, basically, and see who comes. Or would you rather die with one person and don't know if the if other ones loved you? Personally, when I die, you want to know what I want to happen? I want to be burned, and I want to go on a road trip, like cremated, and, and go on a road trip, uh, Route 66. I want my ashes just dumped. Along Route 66. Not its entirety. It doesn't have to be its entirety. Just along Route 66. Just just because. Um, I grew up with a motorcycling family. And Route 66 was a huge part of that. I've never been on Route 66. I want to. I would love to. Which is why I say that. Is because. Uh, anyways. So die in basic and see who comes to your funeral or die with somebody and not see who comes to your funeral. I'd rather die with one person just because most people don't agree with me. Would you rather break up with somebody you still really love or suicide? That got real serious real quick. So um, the top one I've actually done. Um, I'm not going to go, it, it was the same one I was talking about earlier, I'm not going to go into detail with it. Um, I'm going to skip this one, and I'm going to, so would you rather live five nights at Freddy's for make out with Trump and have it recorded? Be honest, live five nights at Freddy's, well, uh, that basically means, so I'd actually be in FNAF 4, which FNAF 4, if I remember right, is the earliest chronologically. 
It's either three or four that's the earliest. I'm not sure exactly. Um, but anyway, so basically FNAF 4, if I remember right, that's the one where you are a little kid in a room and you actually have to go out, check on the doors and all that stuff. And that, you yeah, know. To be honest, I would legit rather have to make out with Trump than, than live in a FNAF world ever. Cause FNAF's scary. It's really, it really is scary. It's a really great story if you don't know it. Um, Markiplier has like a two hour live stream on the whole story of it. So if you want to check that one out, go for it. If you want to know what the story's about. Anywho. I'm going to leave uh, this one here. I'm actually going to see who voted for what. Most people would rather live in FNAF. Would you rather have 20 dogs or zero dogs? Well, let me put it to this simply. To, let me put this to you simply. Dogs are amazing. I don't know why I'm talking like this. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here uh, just because it's running a little longer than I anticipated. My bad. I get wrapped up in this so easily. Anyway, so if you liked it, hit that like button. If you're new, hit that sub button. And to everybody else out there, have a nice day. Goodbye.